coming up in this winter side too. Oh yeah, and we got Madosti. Oh yeah, I was getting there. I was getting there. Uh, oh, yeah. Madosti playing uh, a bunch of characters, just good old fashioned fundamentals. This time it's going to be the Pyra and the Mithra going up against Miles with the Yoshi. Oh my goodness, I didn't even get time to set it up. Oh my goodness, indeed. 70%. 70%. This is late game Yoshi, baby. This is what I'm talking about. Not even Mithra. Not even Mithra can hope to contest that as he double jumps away. It's Yoshi season, baby. I guess it's time. so. 107 and now already on the back foot. Miles finally getting hit a couple Miles. of times. Okay. Madasi trying to get that stage control with the Mithra. Oh my goodness. What an explosive start, though. Oh, indeed, yeah. That's like off of like a single interaction too. But right. Miles actually going to be slipping out between the hits. Not going to be eating that up. He wouldn't have killed, but at least it would have dealt a good amount of damage. They're mm -hmm. just getting into it. They right. were swinging. They were holding forward on the analog sticks. They're playing. And that's what I'm excited to see. We got Miles with a surprisingly defensive option. It's going to be the Nair out of shield. Big edge yep. guard there and going to make it back as well. 99.5. Gonna try and extend the lead. Good armor there. Big extension opportunity. Whoa! I love how bold he is. I'm saying. He's like, you know, his double jump argument gets broken. It does not matter because he is still swinging on the way back down. He is still mm -hmm. swinging. He is still trying to get like his big follow ups and late hit a dash attack. Not able, not able to follow up into the up tilt. Um, but, yo. Can we talk about the crouch too to avoid that landing aerial into the big follow up from Miles. Looking so clean. This might, we might get out early tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Like, what yeah. time is that place close? <laughs> uh, 9 p.m., I believe. Oh, okay, okay. Um, so a little bit of a rush, but mm -hmm. okay. Coming with that back into the up as well. Miles is playing hot. Yeah, I got to say. A lot of really confident options and confident defensive options, too, which is definitely a statement in and of itself. And now we're trying to see a little bit of a comeback here from Adosti. Trying to put that percent on, but Again. there's a... So good. Just saying, hey, you know, this typical ledge trapping flow chart that you think works on everybody else, not me, baby. I'm, able, I'm just able to deny you of that. I am able to use that against you to not only make it back onto the stage, but to use your hit against you and get a hit. Oh. That's still going to be okay. it, though. I, Miles is playing wild. It's Yoshi, so good. Yoshi so clean. was like, I heard about the dinosaurs. I'm taking it back. I'm bring, We're bringing it back. It's been too long. Yeah, <laughs> it's our time again. We're due. Look at this. This is such a great, like, the littlest hit, too. Waiting for the air dodge up, the neutral air. And, and actually, this was like really subtle too. Yeah. This situation could have gone so differently if that just ended up sending to the right, but right. it didn't. The spacing to actually get the butt, the, the, to be able to get the butt, to be able to actually send Madasi outwards resulted in his death. That looked like it would have been the boot. Nope, that was the butt hit. And uh, as a result, Miles is going to be taking game number one. True. We had some ifs, some ands, and most importantly, a butt. Coming in a very clutch, but a switch up in terms of characters could be interesting and could be exactly what the Madoski fans are looking for, too. But it's still Miles with the explosive start. Yeah, we just start the game. Within 30 seconds, mm -hmm. Miles off of a couple of neutral interactions is able to deal 115%. Right. He has his advantage state down. He has his damage output down, and it is so difficult to even match that. Honestly, I got to talk about the sort of like other options too that Miles, like, okay, we know Which the ones? offense is good. The Which hits ones? are good. But even like the positioning, the crouching under certain hits, all these extra options that Miles is picking, they're just so fantastic. It really turns into a complete play style. It's the grill marks on the stake, you know? True, it, it gives yes. it that visual impact on the plate, mm -hmm. you know? And uh, all of a sudden, you know, he's trying to come back down here. He's already got a massive lead for himself. And as soon as he finds that falling late hit neutrally, as soon as he finds that back here, you already know the amount of damage that he's able to get off here. But I will say, I do like the switch to Joku right. simply because, hey, getting back onto stage is infinitely times less difficult. Yep. Oh, nice wait there for the Rebels guard. Trying to put that pressure on, catching the landing off of that platform too. And you, look at that, the shield into the nair. Good stuff, but that Arsene Bear mm. going to open up the stage. Good stuff. Yeah, like a super dissonant ledge option. They're just able to jump back on. They catch uh, Miles off guard a little tiny bit. And ooh, somebody wanted that kill. Somebody wanted that jump call out and did not find it. And as a result, look at the uh, punish that he's eating for them. Right. And there it is, the side special as well. Going to open up the stage. Looking for a big hit there, but there is that crouch again. Ooh. 
Oh, right. All right, I like that. That's I like cool. what both players were cooking up. Yes. That yeah, was yeah. a cute. Like, I was actually really surprised at the back hit of Yoshi's down smash. She didn't catch uh, Madasi's tech roll in, but Madasi had the most optimal fluid punish. Mm. And to be able to get that on Yoshi, right, right. your timing has to be pretty perfect so that he doesn't double jump out of anything. And you have to do it with confidence, too. Speaking of confidence, a big forward air going to start up yep. a lead for Miles. Fighting back, too, with that armor, and what a reversal. <gasps> oh, <laughs> Miles is looking for it all, Ooh. and I love that upbeat to come back down. That was so good. And some other really good offensive options as well. Fighting back yet again. Miles has almost turned every edge guard <laughs> okay. into some sort of positive opportunity instead, but big Arsene Bear. This is do or die right now. Ooh. Okay, now for uh, Modesty, it's not looking like a lot of do at this Ooh. point, but what a counter, actually. All right, turns out we got a little bit of do. Not a lot of die. 65, Arsene going to hang out for just enough to matter here, I think. Okay, that's big, but the armor has been so huge. It just interrupts all of these combos, right. all this potential like damage output. Miles is just able to mitigate like all of these top twos and what they do best Ooh. and just say, hey, that damage output, I'm going to cut it in half. But hold on. I mean, Arsene did, in fact, stay around for long enough to matter and a couple <gasps> of Ehas, but 120? Oh, no, not like that. Jumping in like that to force that goal, to, to, to position yourself for it, to scare somebody into going, and then still be able to cover it like that, that was that was such a cool jump in. Yeah, talk, I thought talk that, to him. Look right was, there. Amazing. He just jumped in. He didn't commit to anything immediately. He was like, you know what? I'm going to get up close to you in your face, and yep. then you're going to lean in a little bit closer. Like this, right. And then pow, that's going to be the tail like, hit. It, it, there's such confidence, too, because like, look at the situation, too. Is, is like the landing down here knows that it's going to miss to jump in and catch that roll into uh, what is eventually ended up being confirmed with the delayed up air. Good stuff. But I like that sticking with the so joker. That was so tight. It was so good. Uh, and that's what, it, that's what it really comes down to. Remind me, I have a speech prepared. After this set. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I'll explain it all. <laughs> oh, okay. Big Arsene, but it did not matter. As soon as he came, uh, he went. Two stocks, the three already. He Hasn't went. Even been... He's going. Yeah, Miles he is getting away with double jumping back onto the stage. Mm -hmm. And uh, Madasi has yet to find a consistent punish on it. He has to respect that big Yoshi thing. Yes. His nose? <laughs> Well, his double jump too, ah, but I suppose right, right. I suppose that is <laughs> a really big Yoshi thing to respect. <laughs> his brain? Oh my goodness! I, yeah, his brain too. Yeah. The, the down special. His boot. True. That's a big boot. Everything about Yoshi is <laughs> big. big yeah. He just has like cartoonous <laughs> like proportions. Oh, that <gasps> is that it? That wow. was so smart. <laughs> what a good trade! That was so smart. Sticking the neutral air out to stop that recovery. That's the best way to punish tethers. Yeah. You just need a nice active hitbox, a nice little kick in the form of Yoshi's neutral air. Just drift out there, nice and gentle, and uh, that's all that it really takes sometimes. So beautiful stuff. Now, Badasi is playing from a massive deficit here. Mm -hmm. Last stock, 80%. This isn't looking so spicy. No, even Miles said, you know what? I'll hit that Rebels Guard. Bring your friends. You're gonna need them. But. Okay. Arsene coming in, clutch. Gonna stick around again for a little bit. Somebody got a little uh, ambitious off yes, stage. Yes, that is a good word for it. Uh, hopefully not one. Oh, what the heck? Not one that Miles comes to regret so far. Still playing pretty well. Still solid lead. I'm surprised he didn't like go off with the new trilogy that time around. Right, right. But maybe just not trying to risk it. <gasps> I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> not trying to risk it. I don't think that's the option you pick. But what a showing. What a Why? final game Why? from Miles. Why? Sometimes Why not you... anything else? Why not neutrally? The, the safest option. Why? Because this this forward air wins you the next like three sets. That's that's the thing. Neutral air, that wins you the game, whatever. That forward air sends a message. Says next time you go home. That's a that's a 3 0 kind of forward air. Uh, I'm forward saying, air. yeah, yeah. He was on his last talk too. Yeah. And you well, I maybe okay. maybe maybe someone heard. Said, my, oh, Miles doesn't like to risk it. I'll show you. Know, I'll show you. I'll show you. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, congrats to Miles. He played hot. Yeah. He played, like, dominantly. On fire. Honestly, I might have to pick. Uh, you know, I was already feeling Miles is going to take it, but, like, oh, yeah. I got to change that to a very confident, uh, definitely going to happen. Even, couldn't even live that, perhaps. It's not that he's going to take it. He's already taken it. Yes. Yeah, and, yeah. and several other timelines, this has already uh, resulted in his victory. Um, but, yeah, that was a little bit off for him, but I'll see that yeah. Miles just seemed to really be, like, super confident in those, like, matchups. He knew all of his follow ups. And, uh, my friend. I do believe you had something to uh, show yeah, with us. Yeah, okay, so the the thing that sort of jogged my memory on this 
was the spacing in that last game around that down air, the jump in to catch the roll and the up tilt. I was thinking on my way down here, I was like, you know, a lot of these tournaments are very, uh, they're like movies, if you will. But Xeno to me is a film, you know? It's not the Expendables. It's not like Transformers. Michael Bay doesn't direct Xeno. House of 3000 does. And it turns into this, real, you know, it's, it's not something that you sit in the theater and you go, oh, wow. It's something you go home and think about. This is the Thinking Man's Tournament. That's what I'm saying. This is it. That's what I'm saying. This is for scholars, philosophers, thinkers. Yeah. They, they write papers about Xeno sagas. I read them. Some of them are good. <laughs> Some of them. <laughs> <laughs> but we have plenty more to write about. In fact, 